Hey everybody, Christopher Walker here, and in this short video I'm going to teach you the basics of natural testosterone production. One thing really quickly though before we dive in, I just wanted to show you this. It's my last lab test. My testosterone is pretty high. Excuse the uh, the crazy squiggly lines, I'm not very good at drawing with the mouse, but, but you'll see my testosterone is above the medical reference range. Heck, even I was surprised when I saw this. Considering where I was just a few years ago, this is quite the improvement. Long story short, I have a brain tumor, and one of the things it does is block testosterone production. Well, it did until I figured out how to release its hold on my pituitary gland naturally. No meds, no gels, and no needles. Everything happens for a reason, and as if by divine plan, my tumor diagnosis came when I was smack dab in the middle of my neuroscience degree curriculum at Duke University. After struggling with ups and downs, both psychologically and medically, I made the life-changing decision to take my health into my own hands and not leave it at the mercy of the doctors or the pharmaceutical industry. I was in the absolutely ideal situation to learn exactly what I needed to do to get better. And as a 20-year-old guy, testosterone production was at the top of my priority list. Having low testosterone sucks, and mine was almost zero. So what did I do to eventually get my testosterone up so high? Well, let's talk about it. Natural testosterone production is entirely rooted in your endocrine system, the complex interplay between your organs, your gut, nervous system, and your hormones. It sounds complicated, and it definitely is. But when you break it down into real-life executable action steps, it becomes stupidly simple. It's not easy, but it's simple. It all comes down to taking action under three main pillars. You need the correct nutrition, you need the correct training, and you need the correct lifestyle. I break all of these down into a ton of detail in the testosterone IO program below this video, but let's talk really quick about the t uh, and take a quick tour of the pillars and, s and see what's up. Uh, in terms of nutrition, you need to understand the roles of both carbohydrates and fat in the optimal diet for men. Hint, if you're on a low carb diet, you're not doing yourselves any favors. You also need to know the importance of cholesterol in your diet and how to use intermittent fasting to manipulate testosterone, growth hormone, cortisol levels. Do soy, BPA, or tea boosting herbal supplements have any effect on your testosterone levels at all? I answer those questions in the program. It's really interesting. In terms of training, we take a deep look at the scientific literature in order to come up with the optimal training routines. If you read my fitness blog, nogym.net, you probably remember me laying out an argument for why the muscle-up is the perfect testosterone-enhancing movement. Don't worry if you can't do them yet. I, I lay out three complete training progressions, beginner, intermediate, and advanced, to help guide you through in your quest for strength and high testosterone and growth hormone levels. Do you know how to train your neuromuscular system? And do you know how vitally important your neuromuscular system is for testosterone production? We take a deep look in the program. In terms of lifestyle, you need to live a certain way to optimize your testosterone production. Long story short, if you have low T, you probably have high cortisol, which means you have too much stress in your life. If you want some simple and free advice, I'll say this. Find ways to eliminate that stress. Heck, change jobs if you have to. Eat correctly, sleep more, train correctly. Stress is an incredibly nuanced topic to discuss, especially in the lifestyle context. Uh, but in the program, we look deeper into many topics in your lifestyle and answer quite a few pressing questions. Like, is more sex better? What about masturbation? What effect does that have on your testosterone? What about sleep, technology, office jobs, social interactions, posture? How about cold showers? Does that idea have any weight at all? What's the relationship between testosterone and body fat? Uh, that's very interesting. And how can you make sure you routinely wake up with a strong morning wood? Hopefully I can say that. We look at all those in both editions of the program, but in the black edition, fancy, we also look at a few more uh, special topics, like can you grow taller? Hint, I did grow two inches once I started doing this process that I lay out in the book and uh, a couple years ago. So over the last couple years, I've grown two inches and now I stand six foot, four inches tall. It's pretty cool. Uh, what about alcohol, BPA, and other toxic substances leaking into your body? Do they have an effect? What about male pattern baldness? Another interesting thing is looking at how to get tested. This is especially helpful for people uh, without health insurance, and this is one of the main questions I get, actually, in terms of emails from people. Uh, 
you don't want to break the bank to get tested. You'll also get the training plans. You'll get four sample menus for different weeks so you can learn how to eat properly by actually putting the nutrition plan into action. And you even get an audiobook version. So you can just sit and relax and listen to my sexy voice narrate the book, which is great for your car, cooking, working out, walking, etc. So let's take a quick look at who this program is not for. It's not for everybody. It's not for men who don't take action. Also, if you don't eat meat, you'll be sorely disappointed with the nutrition section. Though the training and lifestyle sections will still be helpful. However, you're going to have a really hard time with natural testosterone production in general as a vegetarian or a vegan. Who else is it not for? It's not for guys who are afraid of challenging themselves in training. These training programs are accessible, but even guys with years of experience in the weight room may need to start with the beginner program because neuromuscular training taxes your system deeply. It is the great equalizer. However, beginners will be fine. There is room for everybody in this program. And there is no shame in starting from square one. View this as an investment in your health moving forward and a commitment to yourself. Get the plans and take action. Do it and you'll see the results. Anyway, for more info, check out all the great stuff below this video. And one last thing before I go. If you decide that this is the right solution for you, please promise me something. Promise me you'll put the plan into action. It takes some effort and time and patience. Three to six months, most likely, but you'll see huge results in three to six months time. It's not a quick fix. It's not a magic pill. It takes effort. And when you do, I want to hear about it. So shoot me an email, chris at testosterone.io, and I'm looking forward to hearing about your results. Check out the stuff below and enjoy. Bye.